Hey, this is the Swedish Guitar Nerd and today I'm gonna do a comparison and yeah, I've compared a lot of different uh, guitar models and well, it just makes sense that I should do the most popular, the most sold guitar model in the world. So today it will be a comparison between the Fender Stratocaster, standard Stratocaster, made in Mexico, and the Squire standard Stratocaster made in Indonesia. Um, yeah, this is a very, I mean, this is the one of the, yeah, this is the most sold guitar, electric guitar model in the world. Uh, it's specs is very well known and well used and well, yeah, it's, it's copied a lot. Um, and these guys are doing it for real. These are the proper licensed ones. So the difference between these two aren't that dramatic in construction. They are basically exactly the same, uh, at least in shape. The neck and the body, they are identical in shape. They are exactly the same. Um, they both have proper, real good tuners. Uh, it's not that big of a difference they are slightly smoother on the uh, fender one but it's not really that big of a difference uh the, they both have these i i chose the ones with uh maple uh, necks and fingerboards and they are both one piece maple necks and uh, they differ in the way that uh the mexican one has it has gloss finish both on the back and the front, but the gloss finish in the back is less glossy. So it's, I don't know, it, I think it's a perfect match between the two. It's very, I don't know, it feels solid and it doesn't get sticky like uh, regular gloss finishes do. The Squire, on the other hand, uh, is satin finished on both front and sides. And uh, yeah, a lot of people like satin finishes. So this is feels much more like, I don't know, uh, yeah, real wood, uh, bare wood. But over time, if you play this for year, some years, I don't think you'd notice that much difference, actually. The thing is, the fretboard on the Squire will get dirty a lot f faster than the Mexican one because yeah that's what happens when you have a satin finish but on the other hand that's what people like apparently because you buy like pre broken pre dirtied guitars uh, they both have rather jumbo frets and that's to me kind of strange because if there's not one thing that Fender Stratocasts are known for is the small sized frets so I don't know why they've gone for this on the standard models. Um, and I'm not really a big fan of it. Uh, I really like the smaller frets. Um, so, yeah, I don't know why people probably like it. That's why, but they are the same, same, exact same measurements. Uh, the Squire Standard has an extra fret. It has 22 frets and the Mexican one has 21. Mm, yeah. So, yeah, you get more frets for the money. <laughs> and, and then it's, yeah, the same thing. The, the tremolos differ. The Squire has a two-point uh, tremolo that's close. It's trying to mimic the American uh, Stratocaster, the tremolo on that one. And, um, yeah... I haven't tried the, the tuning stability, but in theory, this should hold the tuning much better than the standard one that doesn't hold tuning at all. I tried this one. <laughs> Just some slight use of the whammy bar and then out of tune it goes. Uh, but again, that's probably, I mean, people want it to be like it's always been, I don't know what's wrong with guitar people uh, so uh, well I, I'll say the in my opinion the tremolo on the squire is better and it's also it has this brass 
inserts into the body where it's connected. So the transfer, even if it's two points, the transfer of vibrations, trust me, it's better on this one. You could probably argue with me that it's six ones on the others, but these are so much more solid. So I'd say this is better. The bodywood differs. Uh, the standard from uh, Mexico has uh, all the body, and this has uh, the Squire has a, a Gathis body, which is kind of strange because Squire seems to have all their and all their other models, and uh, even the cheaper ones. I don't really get it. And yeah, all the sounds better. I'll tell you that it sounds better. Okay, um, yeah, let's try them out then. I'll start with the Mexican Strat. And I won't go through every pickup combination. I will do the bridge pickup alone. I will do uh, the mid and neck pickup together and the neck pickup. And I've turned down the tone knob slightly on the neck pickup on both guitars. So yeah, first a clean sound with the Mexican. <laughs> Okay, and here's the squire on the clean sound.
Uh, yeah. Uh, I don't know if it's audible, but uh, the pickups on the Squire is m not at all as loud as on the Mexican one. Uh, but the feel when you play them is the same. They feel excited. It's like playing the same guitar. It only is like the the finish of the neck is the only thing that sets them apart playing wise. You don't notice anything else. The resonance and the, the feel of the guitars are. Yeah, it's completely identical. I can't tell any difference. So I don't know if you switch the pickups and put these ones in the Mexican. I don't know. <laughs> that would be, yeah, interesting to see. But yeah, okay. Let's do some high gain sounds. I'll start with the uh, the Mexican strat. <laughs> Finally, the squire on high gain. I did a sustain test there, the E note on the A string. I'm gonna do that on the Mexican as well. Mm. 
Yeah, the Fender standard sustained much longer. Uh, it's really hard to tell if it's the construction or if the if it's the pickups, uh, because if you have more output, it yeah, it amplifies the the note, so it's it's kind of hard to tell, because you don't feel. As I said, I don't feel that much difference when I play it. Uh, I mean, you can tell from uh, the details that the Fender standard, it's, yeah. I don't know, it looks more posh. It looks more um, well-made when you look into the details. But playing-wise, it's not much of a difference. Um, they are very, very, very alike. Same necks, same. They have both have the nine and a half inch radius, where it, where it's flat for Fender standards. Yeah, that's my comparison. Um, yeah, I hope I found this useful. Yeah, basically the Mexican standard, the Fender standard, is twice uh, the price of a Squire standard. So. Yeah, is it twice as good? Well, that's up to you to have an opinion on. Yeah, this has been the Swedish Guitar Nerd. Uh, comparing the Fender Mexican Standard uh, Stratocaster and the Squire Indonesian Stratocaster Standard. Hope you found this useful. See you soon. Bye.